So Maria, new season, uh, what are the hopes for Cork this year? Uh, look, I suppose we just want to continue to improve and put pressure on the top three and top four teams and just continue to do well. And the like, pre-season has been well and we've been training and working hard. So, you know, we just want to put that onto the pitch and progress from there. You said top three or top four and Cork finished fifth last year. So is, is that the aim to maybe move up? Move up uh, position wise and points wise this year. Yeah, no, we're looking to get more points on the board and push up, maybe push for fourth, third, or see how we, how we go. I suppose with the when the league fixtures come out, everyone looks at the first game and Cork have got a pretty tough one in the in the league champions. Do you feel that with a positive result in that game, you can go on and maybe make a statement to the other teams in the league that shown you'll be a very tough opposition? Yeah, this definitely. Year? I mean, Piedmont are a good team and they've obviously brought in good signings, but at the end of the day, like it's going to be a tough test for us, but. It's a game of football and anything can happen out on the pitch. So, And if we do get a result out of it, then it just shows to other teams that you know, we're here to compete and uh, compete up on that, the top. I suppose looking at it, if uh, with the league, as you said, hoping for an improvement in that, but if, if you had another cup run and maybe even got back to, to the Aviva like you did a few years ago, that would be all seen as yeah, progress. That would definitely build, build a team, build a, build a club, and you know, we can progress further then after that. And That would be great if we could... You know, push further on in the cup as well and make a return to the Viva. Best luck for 2020. Perfect. Thank you.